so we need to show that there are two players with the uh, same total score so uh, let us assume a contradiction that there are no uh, two players who have the same score that means all the uh, 10 players have different scores so now uh, suppose to the contrary that the 10 players has 10 different total scores so this implies that at most one player so at most one player can have zero score and at least nine players have either positive or negative scores so all the 10 players have different scores so there can be at most one player uh, whose score is 0 and there can be at least uh, 9 players who have either a positive or negative score. Now uh, let us now uh, consider uh, these players to be objects and the uh, boxes to be our scores. So boxes will be either uh, positive or negative. Uh, so now we will use the region or principle. So treat uh, these players as objects and create two boxes one for positive and one for negative scores and now by p general principle so when you take 2 into 4 plus 1 so that will be equal to 9 so therefore by p general principle so there will be at least so here n is equal to 2 and k is equal to 4 so there is at least uh, 5 players uh, who have positive scores or there are at least 5 players who have negative scores. So therefore uh, there are at least so k plus 1 will be equal to 5 so there is at least 5 objects in one of the boxes. Okay? Uh, there is at least 5 players who have positive scores or there is at least uh, 5 players who have negative scores. So there are at least 5 players uh, who have positive scores or at least 5 players who have negative scores. Now uh, let us assume that 5 players have positive scores. Okay. So let us assume that 5 players have positive scores. And now since uh, me number assume that three is that total scores are different than so since the total scores are different the sum of the scores the sum of the scores is at least 
So, Anjuverka positive score or under any Ella positive scores um different anna. So, uh, the minimum scores uh, they can have is 1, 2, then they can have 3, 4, 5. So, this is the this must be the minimum sum of the scores. So, sum of the scores is at least 1 plus 2 plus 3, 4 plus 5. Now, when you take the sum, this will be equal to 15. Uh, but as you know, uh, there are only 13 games uh, which did not end in a draw. Upon maximum score curriculum 15 hour patilla. Kanam 13 games a uh, maximum in jedalim. So the number of scores gained will be only maximum 13. So uh, this implies. that there must be at least 15 games which did not end in a draw uh, contradicting the assumption. So therefore we get a contradiction sense uh, because there cannot be at least there cannot be at least 15 games which did not end in a draw. So hence our assumption is wrong. So therefore there are two players. Who had the same total score? So that is the solution using the pigeonhole principle.